If Whitney is frightened in her own home, that's reason enough to suspect abuse, and we have to report Rich to DCFS. You didn't see how torn up he was. Oh, no, that's because I was talking down a 12-year-old whose father had violated her privacy. The EEG showed a lesion on his temporal lobe, which is causing subclinical seizures, which manifests as hypersexuality and an inability to control his impulses. You're making excuses for a pedophile? No, he's not a pedophile. Rich never laid a hand on Whitney, and there's been no prior history of this kind of behavior. But now, right now, Rich admits to having sexual feelings for Whitney. Okay, a guy like that, he doesn't get to be your dad, Sheldon. Sudden behavioral changes. Scarring on the temporal lobe. This is a textbook case of Cooper Busey. You're gonna report it? We'd be accusing him of child molestation and potentially ruining his life. What about Whitney's life? What are we supposed to just wait until Rich takes the next step? He won't because I can fix him by removing the lesion. Can you guarantee that? Okay, even if she could stop his sexual urges, how's this guy expect to ever win back his daughter's trust? Is accusing him of being a sex offender a better way to rebuild that trust? Forget all that. Whitney's safety has to be the top priority. Then let me help this family. I can do it.